Hello beaver fans, welcome back to another one of Mike's videos of beavers. Today's video is a bit longer and it is a series of clips that were all taken within the course of about 45 minutes on August 8th as the beavers were very busy. The video starts off with a younger beaver heading up the rocks to find some food. Um, you'll see shortly after he gets to the top he gets frightened by a dog that comes by and hustles back down to the water. After that beaver swam away, I went about 40 meters downstream. I encountered this large group of a mother mallard with seven ducklings who are almost as big as her now. They swam up to where there was an adult beaver there and he vacated briefly while they went by. And uh, after they stopped, he went back to where he was eating and continued with his dinner. Meanwhile, I heard some noise behind me, so when I turned, uh, just on the other side of me, there was another beaver coming up the rocks. I don't know if this was the same one that hopped in the water before. I don't think it is. And that beaver headed up to get uh, a snack, and as you'll see, after grazing for a little while, that beaver came back to the water too. Followed that third beaver downstream and got there just in time to see him putting a bunch of sticks and mud on a big rock. I'm pretty far away, but I zoomed in so we can see him marking his territory here. And when I pan the camera back, you'll see that I'm uh, downstream of the University Bridge right now. And I think that beaver was trying to let these ducks know that it's beaver territory because he swam up to the prairie lily dock and uh, marked his scent on the main scent mound that marks the border of their territory. After he swam under the dock, I realized that adult beaver had also come upstream by the prairie lily dock and was on the shore 
grabbing some greenery and once he found something to eat he sat down by the river's uh, edge and went about eating his dinner. After eating his dinner, that adult went back upstream and walked out of the water right in front of the ducks to mark his territory. I think he was saying, yes, you might have made me move off my spot earlier, but uh, hey, just a reminder, I'm bigger than you and this is my territory. But as you can see, the ducks do not seem to care either. They're just continuing with their little preening routine. And uh, really, like always, the beavers and the ducks more or less just ignore each other. Just a minute or two later, a smaller beaver came from across the river and just sort of paused where he was, surprised to see so many ducks there and, um, and, and thought better of approaching. After a quick moment of contemplation, that uh, little beaver just kind of went around the ducks and came up on the shore a little closer to where I was standing and uh, made a little scent mound there. Two of the smaller beavers then uh, moved a little further downstream, uh, right around the prairie lily. And uh, then this one little beaver decided to mark his territory on the rock. Um, you'll see he's uh, not as big as the adult was, and it's a little harder for him to get up on top of the rock, but he manages. At that point, another beaver came from across the river, and at this point, I think I had seen about five different beavers from this family, although they are hard to tell apart, but judging on where they came from and where they went, I think there were five different ones. Anyways, this one went up on shore to look for something to eat as well.
after a quick dinner, that last beaver came over to the other side of the observation dock and made a little scent mound, uh, scent pile right next to the main scent mound. And after she does that, I'll pull back the camera and you'll see the beautiful riverboat sitting there at dock while all this beaver activity is going on. We're getting near the end of the video. This is the last clip. I headed back upstream and sat on the rocks and you'll see there were five beavers along the rocks at this point, although the, that one is taking off now. There was one sitting there eating and two more sitting here. And then the fifth beaver was actually sitting and eating right in front of me, which I'll show you in a sec. Thanks for tuning in. I hope you enjoyed all these clips. It was a magical night and I'm so glad to share it with you. Cheers.